Viewer questions. Ahmed writes in, hey guys, have you ever come across a Mac or PC app other than iTunes that streams music to an Airport Express? I really want to use AirTunes to listen to tons of stuff, not just my iTunes library. For example, while watching YouTube, I could listen to the audio on airport connected speakers around the house. And it would be awesome if the app would be free. Ahmed in the London. UK. In the London. Well, In sure. The London. Yeah, there are actually a few that we know of. Um, so for anyone who doesn't already know, AirTunes allows you to play your iTunes music over an Airport Express device to speakers that you connect around the house, kind of like a Sonos. It's a mystical, why, basically it's, yeah. It's, you it's, just plug an audio, an audio cable from the Airport Express to the nearest speaker system with right. it plugged in the wall and it, it works fine. Um, Airfoil from Rogue Amoeba is one of the best apps for Mac or Windows or Ever. Linux even ever that will let you stream almost any audio from from your machine to uh, your airport express they even have the included airfoil video player so you can get local video and remote audio in sync nice. and like i said it works on linux it'll put you back 25 bucks or so but it has so many features that i think it's totally worth the money for yes. all the stuff that you get in this one app. It is a delight. First of all, Rogue Amoeba writes great software. Second of all, that is a particularly useful application. And third of all, iTunes copied Rogue Amiga's Airfoil application to basically and, and to just have you to give you the ability like you used to have to download one of Rogue Amoeba's applications if you wanted to stream like select which uh, Airport Express around the house you wanted to stream to instead of just yeah. streaming to one. So um, you was there one for like micro AEP? What was that program? It's called? called it's called OAEP. Um, OAEP. It's for Windows only, but it'll play any audio from Winamp, uh, Media Player, whatever other software you use. It's a little more try or true on risk. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't I haven't used this one myself. I haven't tested it yet. Yeah. But you it's it's free, so that's good. Donation based. You can give donations if you want to. Um, but judging from some of the forum postings I read, it's worked. So that's a good sign. And in some cases it hasn't. I, I didn't see any that haven't, but I, I need to do a little more research on that one. So if you want to read up on it a little bit more before you give yeah. it a shot, definitely recommend to. Um, there's also a plugin that we found that you can get for Winamp. It's called uh, the Remote Speakers Output Plugin. And it's for 10 or $25, depending on which license you buy. Right. And that gets you updated versions further down the line. So you've got some options out there. But I would definitely recommend Airfoil. Yeah, we both used it quite a bit and, and recommend it. And Rogue Amoeba in general makes awesome software. I use Audio Hijack Pro. Mm -hmm. I've used Nicecast in the past. Go check out their website. They've got a ton of great, ton of great apps for, for Mac and Windows too. And a lot of free stuff.